Hello guys, welcome back to Civil Engineering YouTube channel. Please subscribe our channel for daily civil engineering videos. In today's lecture, we are going to discuss the gamma C and gamma S values in the reinforced concrete design. You may have observed these two values in the Eurocode design because these are the material safety factors in the Eurocode. So gamma C and gamma S both are the partial safety factors for the material. Partial safety factor materials so gamma c here c represent the concrete so gamma c means the partial safety factor for concrete similarly gamma s where s represent the safety factor for the steel for the reinforcing steel so we have two different design conditions and accordingly we have two different uh, values for each of these material. For example, here I can draw it here two design conditions. One is the design condition. Here we have gamma C, the partial safety factor for the concrete and gamma S here, the partial safety factor for the reinforcing steel bar now here again if I write here so we have two different design situation are the condition one is called is the persistent persistence and the transit design condition it means that the in normal condition or we can say in the temporary conditions for for these for this condition we have gamma C value of 1.5 most of the time we take this value because in our normal use we have concrete and for this purpose we take the value of 1.5 where in case of the gamma is which is the partial safety factor for the steel bar in such a design conditions we take the value of steel bar 1.15 in the second case we have accidental condition accidental the accidental conditions in such a design condition in accidental design conditions we took we took the value of gamma c equal to 1.2 and gamma s equal to 1.0 now we also see here that the concrete value is greater if we see here 1.5 is greater than the 1.15 and also 1.2 is greater than the 1 so it is because that the concrete that the concrete material is manufactured on the site most of the time where we have temperature changes and temperature can affect the concrete strength also we have humidity changes and also we have a segregation phenomena in the concrete which can affect the concrete more that's why we want to take the higher value of the factor of safety for the concrete now if you look to the steel bar value the gamma is so in case of the steel bar, a steel bar is manufactured in the company, uh, so there are in the factory, so there is no need to take the higher value of factor of safety because there is no uncertainty in the reduction of their strength. It is manufactured in the company, that's why their value is taken as higher. While concrete is manufactured on the site, that's why that's why their values are taken as higher as compared to the steel partial safety of factors. So these two values gamma C and gamma S are referenced to the uh, partial safety factors and the reinforced concrete design in the Eurocode. Hope you guys understand and don't forget to subscribe our channel for daily civil engineering videos. Thank you for watching our video.